Paul Graham from OptimalBody.ca. Today I'll be answering the question, why is visceral fat more dangerous than subcutaneous fat? The reason is very simple. Researchers have linked visceral fat to a number of different diseases, such as heart disease, stroke, Alzheimer's, colorectal cancer, breast cancer, high blood pressure, and high cholesterol levels. They're not entirely sure how these things are linked, but they have three theories. One of the theories is that visceral fat produces more of a certain type of protein that causes inflammation in the body's tissue, organs, and causes blood vessels to restrict. Second theory is that visceral fat interferes with your normal hormonal production and function. The third theory is that visceral fat is near the hepatic portal veins. This is how your body gets things from the digestive tract to the liver. With visceral fat so close to this system, it can actually change and alter what types of fats are in your blood, which of course can impact your health. One important thing to understand is that even though someone might not be really overweight, they could still have higher levels of visceral body fat. A really easy way to get a rough idea of your visceral fat levels is to do a waist to hip ratio. There's a link above my head right now. You can click on that and watch a video that teaches you how to calculate your waist to hip ratio. So now you have a clear understanding why visceral fat is more dangerous than subcutaneous fat. Visceral fat around the organs increases your likelihood of getting heart disease, specific types of cancer, type two diabetes, Alzheimer's, and a host of other health issues.